Mr. Waka Waka You just a Waka anyhow So so scatter scatter One man way to life the trouble uh, It's my Lord of say I say look out oh. Why may he go and tap a lava nine the fraction You know carry come, you know go carry go Nobody go be check for what you do our lives are molded by our thoughts and our actions. But what do you do when the actions of another affects your life? Welcome to another episode of The Altered One, where we expose the harmful effects drug abuse has on our youths. Previously on the show, Femi spiced up the food he cooked with some wraps of Indian hemp, despite Ibrahim's warnings. Ugo, who visited Ibrahim, eats from the food, unaware of the contents, and has just refused to wake up. Ugo, Ugo, oh, what kind of temptation is this? Ugo, Ugo, Femi, what are you doing just staring at him like that? Won't you, won't you think of something to do so that he wakes up, considering you're the one that instigated all of this? My friend, keep quiet. Uh, did I force anyone to eat the food? I beg, just pour some cold water on him, I beg. He might wake up. Might. You're not even sure. <clears throat> Take. Pour it on him. Wait. I don't understand. Why should I be the one to do it? Eh? Come on. Me, I don't understand any of this your plan, no. Wake this guy up, I beg. Huh? Let me find my way out of here. He's the one holding me here. Femi, you amaze me sometimes. Anyway, it's not your fault. What now? Oh, what's the meaning of this? Ah, thank God he's awake. Me, I'm going home. Oh. Uh -huh. Hey, bro. I am taking the remaining vegetables, oh, since you are in no need of it again. Go be. Mm. Hey, bro, what happened? How long have I been asleep since we finished eating? We all slept off. I've been trying to wake you up for over 30 minutes now, but you weren't responding. Hey, are you serious? Huh, but that has never happened to me before. Ah, and I feel really weak. I should have, uh, I, I should be heading home now. It's already late. Uh, but why? You can stay without my place. I, I don't mind. And, and you're forgotten who I stay close to, Abby, eh, so that he can tell my parents that I've been partying all night. Please, I don't have time for his wahala. Eh? Let me start going. Ah, I feel so weak, bro. I don't even have the strength to stand up from here. Or was it uh, the yam that we ate? But it, I, it wasn't that heavy. I didn't even take much. It's not the food. It's not. Maybe it's just uh, accumulated stress. But don't worry, you'll be fine. Let me help you. Thank you, Jari. See you in school tomorrow. All right. Bye. Ha! <sighs> now, wow. What kind of human being is this, Femi? What if Ugo hadn't woken up after pouring him that water? What would I have done? Hmm. This is just pure temptation. And it's high time I cut myself off from Femi before that guy puts me in trouble. I have never felt this way before. I can barely carry myself. Hmm. And all these shops are closed. At least I could have bought something to drink to gain some strength. Hey, 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 stop there. Ah. Stop right there. Who's that? Don't move again. Ah. You? Uh, sorry, you? Um, is it me you were calling? No, nah. How can I be calling you? You not, you not my chairman, nah. Oh yeah, bring him. Bring ah. it out. Let's not waste time. Br bring what? Ah, sorry, uh, sorry. I, I. Why did they do this one? Don't. But like when they give strong men like us bad name. Oh yeah, raise your hand. Make I search you quick, quick. Ah, hundred naira. For this your whole body, as you talk your shirt inside your trousers, so not just hedge day your body. 
guy. Just leave this place before you make me verse. Say you know Sabiron. If I change my mind for you, eh? See ya, see ya, <laughs> see ya. Even they run like person when Bruce Lee come out. No sense. At least this one will do for two raps. Ah ah, Ugo. Take it easy now. We're almost there. Many bro, I can't be almost there until I'm there. It's like you haven't understood this lecturer's technique. Listen, a minute late, he would close the door. Ah, in fact, that man surprises me. Oh. Which lecturer, which lecturer organizes quiz by 4 p.m. in this school when everyone else might have gone home? That's exactly his plan to catch you unaware. I'm mm -hmm. telling you, with the way that man is threatening us with this quiz, eh? Hey, hey, I wonder if there will be any need to even write his exams here. He might even come to the exam hall that day and tell everyone to go home that they have written his own part of the questions in class without even knowing. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, eh, that will be fu Watch out! Ah! My head! Mm. Mm. I'm sorry, eh? Uh, uh, what is I'm your sorry. problem? Are you high on something? Can't you at least watch where you're going? I'm sorry, I didn't see you coming. How were you planning on seeing me when your eyes were obviously closed? Hey, hey, girl, you're getting too far. My guy has apologized already. I already said I'm sorry. And truly, I am. I don't know what else you want me to Brian. say. Lillian, what's going on here? Femi, you know her? Of course I know him. What do you think? Femi, I don't know if these guys are your friends, but you should tell the lanky one here to open his eyes while walking. Look at how he messed up my Lillian. dress. Lillian, <laughs> come on, it's all right. Huh? Uh, he has gotten your message. It's okay. Um, Ugo, that's your name, right? You guys can go on, it's fine. Man, bros, thank you, Jared. Ivro, money, go, money, go, money. Yes, so you need to. He, he just saved you now. Hey, Lillian, calm down now. It's okay. Ah, leave the guy now. He's not the kind of person you think he is, oh. Really? What do you mean by that? Meanwhile, Ugo and Ibrahim missed their entrance to the quiz and had to go back home. Ugo, really angry, blames Lillian for their misfortune. Hi, she has succeeded. Eh? Hope she is happy wherever she is now that we have missed the quiz. I beg, just leave that white witch. I really don't blame her, you know. It's the one who fixes lectures or quiz when someone should be home resting. That's the person I blame. Eh, true, true. She's, she's really a white witch. Really white one. Please, let's just go and find something to eat. I beg, I'm hungry. All my efforts today have just been wasted. Just like that. And that's your guy self, eh? He, he didn't even ask what, what, what the issue was. He just took the girl's part of the story and just went like that. Leave Femi. He's always like that, oh. As long as he gains something from you, you are his best buddy. Who knows what he might have told the girl? Let's find something to eat, Jerry. Forget about all of this. Madam Sabi! Madam Sabi, oh! Yes, so come for my day, come. See, guy, let's sit here. So that one over there can just switch us, you know. Yes, yo. Don't break my bottles. If now fight, now one fight. More than just carrying ourselves, go outside. Mana, please, we need food. I they come first, make I serve person will come before you. Madam, come now. Ah, no be you, I they come me so. And at a corner of Madam Sabi's shop, directly behind where Ibrahim and Ugo were seated, Lillian sits and experiments on different ways to blow out inhaled cigarette smoke. <coughs> Sister, take it easy. You've been choking ever since. <coughs> Why don't you do both of us a favor and just do that thing I brought you here? You hear me? <coughs> oh, sorry, yo. I was just being concerned. I guess I'm wrong to have been. Mm -hmm. Smart girl. <laughs> you guessed right. So please, let me be now. <laughs> I think the lady is just being concerned. <coughs> and she's just being right, you know. You might enjoy yourself. Ah. You? <laughs> you again. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you have anything to do in this school than following people up and down? I, um, um, I, excuse me, 
following you around? Of course not. Um, I, um, I, I, um, <laughs> we just came here to eat, so. Mm. I think you should sleep more. You're really better sleeping than you talk. I don't get you. What? What was that supposed to mean? Hello? Like when you ate that yam that was spiced up with weed and you slept for an undisturbed 10 hours and still didn't get enough sleep that they had to wake you up with a cup of cold water. <laughs> Just wait till my roommate hears about it. She will laugh herself to death. <laughs> Imagine how Ugo feels being betrayed by his one and only friend and having eaten something he wouldn't have thought of coming close to in his wildest imagination. <laughs> Ibro! <laughs> Ibro! What's she saying? Is any of this true? What was Ibrahim's response to Ugo? Is he going to lie again? Or just admit and tell Ugo what happened? Join us as we take you through these tides in the next episode of The Altered One. This radio drama is brought to you by the FCTA.